As part of our programme to help young people, the Sir Simon Milton Foundation is sponsoring a new purpose-built school for 14 to 18-year-olds at Pimlico. The University Technical College will educate and train young Londoners for exciting careers in the engineering and construction industries. So what we're creating here at Ebury Bridge is a world-class, state-of-the-art facility. It's the first kind of school of this type in uh, Westminster and when it opens we'll be providing a fantastic education to 550 uh, young people and the school will specialise in transport engineering and construction. And in my own school if I could have done this I would have done this. To, to remove all the angst for parents having to do homework. We will try and get most of the homework done at school and there'll be a big enrichment programme and the other thing that makes UTC is different is that we will encourage students to develop the skills and aptitudes that businesses require. And to that end, we'll have businesses actively involved in the school, in the enrichment programme and in teaching some of the projects. Work experience placement, business challenges that link classroom learning to the reality of working life, um, uh, site visits to our fully equipped training centres, careers advice, interview practice, everything that can make young people employable in our business and in other businesses. The trailblazer for this new hands-on, business-led, technical education is the JCB Academy in Staffordshire. The curriculum and learning techniques are unique to university technical colleges, allowing students to combine the theory with the practical. The best thing about it is the links with the industry. It sort of opened my eyes to the aerospace engineering. It's prepared me for the future and I have an understanding of what it's like working in industry. We did a project with Toyota last year where we had to make spaces for a Toyota engine. The thing that I enjoy most is getting down in the workshops because it allows me to get hands on with what I enjoy doing. I enjoy working with industry leaders such as Toyota, JCB and Rolls-Royce. Our foundation in 1838, two of the first students were Indian railway engineers. They came here because it was London. We want to make Westminster the heart of that new education. This is a fantastic opportunity for, for us as a, an organisation that employs uh, thousands, literally thousands of engineers, to influence the education and the development of a whole new generation of, of engineers. You couldn't ask for a better location for the particular style of education we're looking for. It's close to the university, it's in the heart of Westminster, the railway is part of that location and part of its history. It's fantastic for young people, uh, particularly to be able to get the technical skills uh, to go into construction, engineering, to work with network rail. Uh, I think this is, this is very good in, for, uh, for helping people, particularly where there are pockets of youth unemployment still remaining. Youth unemployment is falling in this country. Uh, but this will help further, particularly in the Westminster area. The Foundation is absolutely delighted uh, to be uh, involved in this project and there's a whole package of uh, support that the Foundation is providing for young people through from bursaries and uh, really trying to ensure that they are well supported. There's an endowment that the Foundation are setting up to make sure that the school itself uh, is properly maintained over time and always will have the best possible uh, equipment uh, available to it. The Foundation needs your help to change the lives of young people in Westminster. Getting involved is easy and you can contribute to our work by making a donation to our UTC fund. Thank you.